Hi guys, so um, today I'm back with a more festive themed video as you can tell by my very festive jumper. I love this. I'll show you guys. It's from Topshop. I'll link it down below. So it's like fairy tale and then it has the New York skyline. Like fairy tale New York and it's got like little pom poms. Like snow, so cute. <laughs> okay, so you're probably clicking on this because you need some gift inspiration and um, I pride myself on being quite a good gift giver like I put a lot of time into researching stuff and usually I can pick out some pretty good gifts so I thought this would be a really good video for me to do so I'm going to do two this is the first one it's a gift guide for her so this is for your girlfriend for your sister for your mum for your nan um, I haven't categorised anything just because I know that, you know, some people might want to get a sister type gift for their mum. Like, I'm just going to give you a large array <laughs> of um, gift ideas that you might be really into and want to gift a woman in your life. <laughs> so, I've got everything written down on a very long list. And I'm just going to go through it with you, basically. And yeah, hopefully you guys find something in here if you're struggling for gift inspiration. And I thought I'd get it out early enough so that if you are, this might be able to help you. I've got a whole range of price ranges in here, a whole range of different stuff, whether she's sporty, whether she's really into her clothes or beauty or any of that. There's kind of something for everyone in here. So hopefully it helps you guys out quite a lot. <laughs> Um, and just a quick note to say that I will have everything linked down below. Um, just wanted to make this clear because it takes me ages to do so I really don't want you guys to like not know that it's there if that helps you because I know it can take ages to try and find something so it's much easier if I if I link it for you I know that so I will be linking everything. So just so you know. <laughs> okay so first off I am going to start by just a brand, I'm going to say Charlotte Tilbury Makeup. This is such a great gift because of how it's packaged. Charlotte Tilbury Makeup is packaged so beautifully. One thing I'm going to especially recommend for you guys, well there's two things. One, if you have a bit more money to spend, kind of over the £100 mark, then they do sets. Um, so it'll be a look, so you can pick like glam, office, everyday, different kinds of looks and in that you'll get say a mascara, um, an eyeshadow palette, a lipstick, a lip liner, you know, so that's really great if you have a bit more to spend and you know someone that really loves makeup um, because Charlotte Tilbury is just such an amazing gift to receive and everything comes just packaged beautifully but if um, you have a little bit less to spend than around like the £40 mark we have her little quad palettes and these are just beautiful so she does a few different ones one I think is so gorgeous is it's called the palette of pops <laughs> and every shade in there is a really glittery shimmery shade and they're so lovely for the holiday time um, so this is definitely something I'd like to receive I'm also going to do a little section at the end just so you guys know of what I would love to receive for Christmas because um, that might give you some inspiration as well if you know someone around my age anything like that okay but yeah that palette looks gorgeous um, they do all different types of palettes so have a look through their quads uh, what you think the person would like most they do some with more mattes some with more shimmers and yeah I would say her palettes are just lovely so definitely check those out they're a great gift Next up we have kind of under the skincare umbrella, lots of skincare brands are doing sets this for this season and those are really nice gifts um, because you can't always like, skincare is quite expensive and spending a lot of money on one product is quite risky so getting like a trial kit from a company is a really good option, I know Kiehl's do loads of these which is really lovely, you'll get like a little face wash, a moisturiser, maybe a serum or a toner all in a little box or gift wrapped nicely and, um, and and some of them do like a full size one in there and stuff like that as well so those are a really good option next we have and this I think is the best gift um, it goes on all price ranges I'll link a few down below um, so I'll give a few examples it's a card holder so card holders are 
amazing these days. I don't use <laughs> I don't use a proper big wallet purse anymore. I just use a card holder. Um, so there are a few good ones. Katie Loxton does um, a lower price card holder. So does Oliver Bonus. Um, higher price card holders. Basically, every single designer does a card holder. My personal favourites. If you have a lot of money to spend, the Dior saddle card holder is gorgeous. Um, the Valentino card holder is gorgeous and it's someone that's very on trend into fashion, Bottega Veneta, because they're super in now as a brand, so getting a woven card holder would be a really cool gift. But again, a bit on the pricey side. Hey, next we have a super easy one. If you just want to know someone's going to like something, you have about 70, 80 pounds to spend a bit more, so maybe for someone special, it's a Joe Malone perfume. You literally can't go wrong. Um, if you go in and pick it, it's also pretty personal, so that's just a really nice gift. My favourite scents from Jo Malone are, and I think everyone's favourite scent from Jo Malone is probably Peony and Blush Suede. That's a gorgeous one. Very like light and feminine. I love, and I have, I think it's called Honeysuckle and Davina, or Davina, or something like that. Um, yeah, those two are really nice. Also, Pomegranate Noir if you're looking for a deeper scent. Really good one. Next up, watch. So, um, this can actually be a really good value gift because somewhere like Daniel Wellington, I have a couple of watches from them from where I've collabed with them in the past on Instagram. They're really, really nice quality watches. Um, and they're around the £150 mark, but they do some really great um, offers around this time of year where you can get bracelets with them and um, all sorts of stuff like that and they they just look so expensive and they're really gorgeous so as a bit more of a special present um, that's gorgeous and it looks like it could cost more like £500 rather than £150 they're, they're really lovely watches so yeah definitely recommend those next up's a bit of a weird one I'm well aware of this but I think it's a really good one to receive and it's a silk pillowcase <laughs> um, so silk pillowcases, I don't have one but I really want one and they're supposed to be really good for your hair and for your skin because you, you can imagine kind of sleeping on a rough pillowcase what it would do to your hair, kind of more leave it kinked and less smooth <clears throat> so a silk pillowcase effectively what it's doing is just you know not tugging on your skin and hair and it's supposed to be really really good and there's a brand called Slip which does very expensive luxurious ones where you can get gift sets with like a silk pillowcase, a silk eye mask and a silk scrunchie, stuff like that. But you can get cheaper ones on Amazon for like a tenner. So there's a lot of range in that and I'll link a couple below. But I think this is a really cool gift if you're kind of like looking for a stocking filler or something like that. They're really cute. Next idea I have is a nice scarf. So <laughs> um, I'm thinking more with this um, on the designer route kind of like a cashmere scarf, maybe a Burberry scarf or something like that. It's uh, something that is quite expensive, but you would wear that for like the rest of your life and you'd get loads of wear out of it this time of year and it makes every, obviously you've got a piece of design on with every outfit you wear, so it makes everything look expensive and I think this would be a really lovely gift to receive. And Whenever you get something from a designer shop, it's wrapped beautifully, so <laughs> that is always a plus too. Next up we have hair tools. Um, this is for, you know, your hairstyle lover out there. Um, so, there are loads of different price ranges. I'm going to try and find a hairstyler I have that was £20 on Amazon and that is excellent. <laughs> if I can find it, I'll link it down below. That's a great one. If you're looking for more of a luxurious gift, I have um, the GHD curler, which is just lovely, and a GHD straightener, which is also great. Something more upmarket would be the Dyson hair dryer or the Dyson styler. These are just so cool. And like, <laughs> receiving something like this on Christmas would be really fun because it's like, you open presents when you're older and it's it's kind of like, okay, I'm done now. Like, can't do anything with these. It's not like when you're a kid and you spend all day playing with them, but something like the Dyson hair curler, you can just like play with it all day. Like it's it's something that's so novelty and so fun, but also really useful. Um, so that would be a great gift. But again, a bit on the pricier side. 
Next we have anything to do with her favourite TV show. And I think this is a really good one. So, say somebody loves Friends. <laughs> um, a box set. A great gift. Um, pop vinyl figures. Those are really cute. And again, really good gifts. Um, I know they do all sorts. They do like one of Boo from Monsters Inc, which is really cute. All the Harry Potter, all the Game of Thrones, loads of stuff like that. And they're just a really cute stocking gift, really. Also stuff like little Central Perk mugs, stuff like that that relates to the TV show. What I find really useful to do is if someone likes a TV show, just type in that TV show and then like merch or whatever on Amazon. And it comes up with loads like, for example, my dad loves Game of Thrones, so I typed in Game of Thrones stuff on Amazon. <clears throat> and it came up with like a little doorstop that said like Ho Door on it. Um, yeah, so you end up finding stuff that would have never come into your head to search. So that's another really good one. Just Google the TV show and um, yeah, see what merch comes up. Next we have a really sweet one. Um, I got my boyfriend one of these for his birthday and he loved it. It's called Love Book online. <laughs> um, it's a bit more expensive to do. It's about £40 because it all has to be made and personalised. But basically what it is, is if you, you make your cartoon and you make the cartoon of your partner. And then it kind of recommends, it asks you for like a story. Like how you met, your favourite things about the person, stuff like that. And it composes this really, really cute book. And um, yeah, you can just order this hardback book and it's like cartoon versions of you saying like what you love about them and experiences that you've had together that are nice. And it <laughs> it's just such a cute, unexpected gift. And this is such a winner for a girlfriend. Like you, you could do no wrong ordering this if you're <laughs> for your girlfriend, really, you could not. It's so cute, definitely check it out. I think you can get them for like your parents as well. It's not just like your boyfriend. I think you can get them for, yeah, an array of people. So definitely check out their site. Next we have coffee table books because I have like this weird obsession with coffee table books. <laughs> um, so I love like, not necessarily coffee table books, but like a nice hardback book. So like if she's into fashion, maybe one of the Vogue coffee table books. Um, again, go on Amazon, type in coffee table book, it comes up with loads. You get one for your favourite photographer, for, you know, there's loads of ones about like the Earth, like Earth from Space ones, different photography ones. Um, yeah, loads of really great kind of more decorative hardback books that are a bit more special um that are also used like in a decorative way they're really fun and I think they make a really good gift next we have a framed picture can't go wrong with a framed picture really can you that's literally what I have to say just print out your favorite picture of you and the person put it in a cute frame you're done okay next Ugg slippers because I've always wanted a pair <laughs> I don't have any but they look so comfy and cosy and they're just like something that once you have them you have them but you're never going to buy them for yourself which is why I thought they'd be good to put in here because um they're something that people would be so happy to receive as a gift so yeah definitely recommend getting someone who loves maybe more comfy things but also likes a bit more luxury, get them a pair of Ugg slippers. I think they're about £80, but you might be able to find some on sale around this time of year. And yeah, <laughs> they're a really great gift, maybe for a mum. Really good gift for a mum. We have a Polaroid camera. These are, again, something you probably wouldn't really buy for yourself, but something that you can catch uh, really cute memories on. And yeah, make sure if you get them a Polaroid camera to also get them some film because you don't want them opening it and then not being able to take any photos. <laughs> um, but no, it's a really cute thing to do and there are loads of accessories that go with them, kind of like little photo books and stuff that you can put the Polaroids in. And yeah, they're really cute. I like the Fujifilm Instax ones because they're cute and colourful. But along this lines as well, you can also get the um, printers, which... For someone like me, I have a Polaroid camera, but I always forget to take it anywhere. <laughs> With the printers, you can just turn your photos from your phone into a Polaroid and it prints out straight from your phone. So those are really good as well, If you're, but I think they're a little bit more expensive. Next up, we have Victoria's Secret pyjamas. 
Um, yeah, these are again for the comfy person lover, like person in your life who loves to be comfortable and is always in their pajamas. These are a really cute gift. They are so soft. They're like a jersey material, but imagine like the softest t-shirt you've ever felt. They feel like that. And they do them in a few different colours. They're kind of the the classic pyjama look, the long bottoms, the long sleeved shirt kind of thing. And yeah, I have them in the grey and I have them in the pink and um, I love them. They also do silk ones, which I do have, but I just live in the jersey ones. They're such a good alternative. And they, also, they often do um, a sale on them around Christmas time where you can get maybe free slippers and stuff with them. So definitely check that out. Next up we have um, Katie Loxton pouches. I have a few of these and they're really cute and because of the messages on the, on the front they're so easy to gift so um, I think they do ones that say like best mum or they do the ones I have, one says finders keepers, one says Levy and Rose, one says pretty and pink, stuff like that, little sayings all on the front and they are just the cutest, like sweetest little gift. And they're really nice, one for evening clutches, I've used them for evening clutches before, but I've also used them like when I'm going to the airport and you wanna keep all your travel documents together. Really good for that as well. Next up we have, and I've got, I've given this gift a few times, Anthropology um, Agart, I think it's pronounced Agart, um, coaster, you know, like the ones that look like crystal's been sliced, and one of their gorgeous mugs. They do mugs with like your initial on, they're really lovely. Um, and you can also get the coasters with the initials on as well. Um, if you live near an anthropology store, try and get to it. Don't order it online because they do vary in size a lot. So you can get one that's almost double the size for the same price. And when you order online, you never know what one you're going to get. Um, so although you get a really nice one if you order online, it's quite nice to pick it. And they vary slightly in colour as well. So it's quite good to go into a store and kind of select exactly the one that you want. Next up we have one thing that's on my wish list, the comfy. <laughs> so I saw this, uh, I keep seeing it on like Facebook memes and stuff like that, but apparently it was on the, Amer the like American Dragon's Den, I think it's called Shark Tank or something like that, and it's basically like a blanket with a hood that you just put over yourself, and for me I am such a big lover of like fleece loungewear <laughs> like any kind of blanket I always have wrapped around me like fluffy pajamas all stuff like that so this is literally perfect for me and you get it in all different colors just you, you literally can't go wrong it's amazing it looks so good and I'm really hoping I get it for Christmas. Next up a good gift idea for your more active girls in your life um, a yoga mat <laughs> So you can get really cute yoga mats these days. They're into like a sport brand like Lululemon, you can get one from there. What I really recommend is they do these smart yoga mats which have like, they snap at the ends so that the ends don't curl up. Those are really, really cool. And a kind of a different take on like the whole idea. So I definitely recommend maybe looking into that if you have a sporty friend. To go along with that for the sporty friend, um, a bit more expensive, about £80, are the Lululemon Align leggings. I always go on about these, they are the best leggings you can buy. So comfortable, so flattering, so soft. Perf like, if you have someone that's into sport and you get them these, they will love them. They will, they will live in them. <laughs> Next up, we have hot chocolate. So, I love the brand Retard. For hot chocolate they're really cute hot chocolates they're like not your basic one they do a normal luxury hot chocolate but they also do white hot chocolate so to caramel hot chocolate rocky road hot chocolate <laughs> you know like everything you can imagine sticky toffee pudding hot chocolate every type of hot chocolate there is um a really cute gift idea you can get them in a set which my boyfriend got me which is really cool you get like six different flavors amazing or you can get one and maybe you can get them a mug and put some like, a little packet of marshmallows or like make a little gift set out of it um and yeah every girl loves hot chocolate really don't they especially at this time of year so can't go wrong with that one if you're looking for a, a bit of a smaller present that's a bit more luxury like it's not just like a Cadbury's um pot of hot chocolate because it probably wouldn't be like the most impressed with that but this is like a proper gift so 
yeah, really cute. Next is for the luxury lovers again. It's a belt, like a designer belt. So everyone has seen the Gucci belt. It's everywhere, that would be a great one. Also Dior do some really gorgeous belts. Louis Vuitton do some really gorgeous belts. What I'm talking about is kind of like an iconic um, clasp. Um, Cause again, like I said, with the scarf, you wear it with everything. It designers up, like makes, makes your outfit look so much more luxury, so much more put together. A really gorgeous thing to have that they will keep for ages. So if you're, if you're looking for a bigger present for someone, perfect, a nice belt. So next we have Morphe palettes. <laughs> Uh, Morphe palettes are great for the makeup lovers in your life. They're a bit on like the less expensive side for how big they are. Like the James Charles one, I kid you not, is like that. And I think it's £40 or something. Um, so they're much better value than like the Naked palettes and stuff like that. Um, they have really cute colours in. The Jaclyn Hill one is my favourite, but I also really like the James Charles one. Another thing that if she's into makeup and she's into YouTube, um, she will probably like is the um, Conspiracy palette by Jeffree Star and Shane Dawson. If you know she likes YouTube and makeup, get her that into your brain saying. If you can find it in stock anywhere, because I can't. Another one is her favourite food. So this is quite a cool, this is one that you can do quite cool stuff with because if you know, for example, that she loves Reese's Cups, <laughs> um, type in on Amazon. Reese's Cups and it will kind of blow your mind the quantities you can buy these things in <laughs> so for £10 you can get like a box like they sell in like they sell the cups in in shops and stuff like that and that's really quite fun if you know she really likes Reese's Cups stuff like loads of Cadbury's bars just bulk of any snack she likes is a really cool present um, <laughs> and it will last them all year so yeah, that would be a really fun one. Okay, next, this one's more for like a mum, I guess. Uh, and it's a candle. So I'm gonna link a couple. Um, obviously, Jo Malone candles are lovely, but they're quite expensive. Again, Peony and Blush Suede and Pomegranate Noir are lovely scents. Also recommend White Company candles. They have a Christmas, like winter one, which is a, the winter White Company candle is really nice. And that is a bit cheaper. So that would be a really good option as well. Speaking of White Company, another great gift would be one of their gift sets. They do like bath and body gift sets. And again, for a mum, a really, really nice present. And also, while I'm on the, <laughs> while I'm on the subject of White Company, if you, can't, if you don't want to stretch the price of the Ugg slippers, the White Company do some really similar ones that are up there on quality and they're more around £30 mark. So they would be a really good gift, white company slippers. So only a few more left, guys. <laughs> Sorry, this video has been so long. Okay, so, smart mug. Again, your tea lovers, your hot drink lovers, coffee lovers, hot chocolate lovers, whatever. Smart mug comes with a coaster. The coaster keeps the mug warm, basically. It keeps it at like a constant temperature so that it never goes cold. Really cool gift idea. Next we have, a weighted blanket. Now I know this sounds weird but these are like scientifically proven to relieve anxiety and help with sleep and stuff like that. They're supposed to be amazing and really comforting and this could be a really cute one to get if um, say for like your girlfriend if you go away a lot and maybe she doesn't like sleeping alone stuff like that she, she needs more comfort these are supposed to be super comforting and yeah, be a cute gift idea. I really want one because sometimes you just want to like, mm, I get I get why they're comforting because like a blanket then with weight, it's like a hug. So yeah, really, really cute gift idea. Last but not least, we have, and these are really good, I've got my boyfriend's mum some of these, uh, Fortin and Mason's biscuits. <laughs> so they do your classic tins, um, all different flavours which are really nice. And then they do these music tins. So the one I got is like a tin with Fortnum and Mason's like shop front on the front of it. And then you wind it up underneath and it's a musical tin and you can like reuse it, it's gorgeous. And it comes with all different flavor biscuits inside and they're just a really nice gift for like a mum or an aunt or a boyfriend's mum. Really good one.
sorry this is going to be so long but now I'm moving on to stuff I'd like to receive because I thought this would be helpful if you guys knew someone maybe that reminded like you thought would like similar things to me <laughs> is always useful so for me I love card holders any card holder I would be happy to receive because I use my card holder all the time. Since I'm in London a lot, I have my card in there, I have my student card in there, I have my Oyster in there, I have my train ticket in there, <laughs> I have all my, my Boots Advantage card in there, my credit cards, yeah, I rely on that thing so much. And I don't really carry cash. If I have a note, I just sign in the card holder. Super easy. Now, I love bags. No bag in particular I'd like to receive but I love bags, like designer bags are my favourite thing ever. I haven't asked for any, I won't get any, but just thought I'd put it out there. Bags are really nice. Um, one, if, you're, if you want to buy someone a designer bag, but you don't have the budget for a designer bag, maybe a Marc Jacobs, the little ones with the thick straps, they're super in at the moment, and I think they're about £290, which for a designer bag, that's really in is an absolute steal. So I'll link that one down below. They're super cute and I would love one of those. <laughs> okay guys, so next I mentioned earlier, I'd love a pair of Ugg slippers, just cause I love being comfy and I kind of love luxury. So Ugg slippers are a steal. And I'd like the pink ones, they're really cute, but the like tan colored ones are more classic. So they're also good as well. One thing I'd love on that front of being comfy is the comfy. I said about it earlier, it just looks amazing. Another thing I'd be thought would be like a really nice gift that someone might not expect. I love um, the stuff from House of CB for Christmas. It's all so gorgeous, and I would love like a New Year's Eve dress from House of CB. Um, maybe not for like this wouldn't work for a lot of people. You have to really know their style, and maybe more of like a best friend or someone. But they do really lovely dresses. If you know someone's stuck on what to wear for New Year's Eve this could be a really nice gift. Okay, so the one thing I am properly asking for for Christmas is a camera. The camera I'm filming on now, I adore. I got it for photography. So, you know, I love my Instagram and I got it for kind of street style photography. It's the Olympus Pen EPR9. I have the normal lens and I have a 15 millimeter prime lens. I love it. It's amazing. It looks so cute, but I don't think it's the best for filming on. It's not great at focusing, it doesn't have a flip up screen, um, sounds not amazing, it's just, it's not a camera that's made for video, it's a camera that's made for photography. So I really wanted to get a camera for video, not only for YouTube but also like, I love video and trips and stuff like that. So I'm going to ask for the Canon G7X Mark II, I've heard the Mark III isn't quite there yet, people are having a lot of problems with it and I didn't want to risk it and the Mark II is supposed to be so good anyway so no harm in going for that, um, but it's the one that every popular YouTube vlogger uses basically, so I just figured you can't go wrong with that, and I'm really excited to play around with it, hopefully I get it, and hopefully I can film some videos on it for you guys. Next up, I love receiving books, so I would like to receive, I love fashion books, so like anything coffee table like, like Vogue, um, stuff like that, I love, they, they do these little fashion fairy tales, and um, yeah, they're like Elves in the Shoemaker by Manolo Blahnik and stuff like that. And they're super cute. Motivation books I love as well. Grit is a great gift if you know someone that's lacking in motivation. It basically talks about how you can overtake naturally intelligent people with grit and determination. Um, I also love Black Box Thinking by Matthew Syed. Really interesting read. And Outliers by Malcolm Gladwell is really good as well. Those three are really interesting and really easy to get through. So they'd be really good gifts you know, someone that loves smart thinking books. Okay, next up is something I will probably never ask for, nor ever get, because they're just so absurdly expensive, but they're so beautiful. Oh my God, I would love them. And they are the Bang & Olufsen headphones. Bang & Olufsen is like notoriously known as the best like speaker company ever. So it's no doubt that their headphones are great. <laughs> um, so they will do incredibly sounding like incredible sound in them and like the quality will be amazing you don't even have to question that because it's Bang & Olufsen but it's more that they're just so beautiful looking like <laughs> they do a pair for 450 that are the most stunning headphones I've ever seen they also do a cheaper pair at 250 and that's nice but 
they get the same look. <laughs> um, so if you know someone that's really into music, we have a lot of money to spend. Oh my god, what a great gift. But I don't think most people would be able to afford them. So, but I thought I'd mention them just in case. Okay, next up, everyone has them, and they're really basic. But the McQueen trainers, I think they're so nice. Love to receive them. You'd wear them all the time, basically. Like everyone I see in London <laughs> is wearing them, basically. They're so widely worn. Um, they are quite expensive, but they don't break the bank for a designer shoe, especially not from a brand like McQueen. So, yeah, they're quite they're quite a good gift, I guess, if you have around the two to three hundred pound mark. Very good one. And next, last but not least, is jewelry. So, I don't really wear jewelry that much, but I've gotten a lot more into it recently, and there are a few brands that I would definitely recommend for gifts. First up is Edge of Ember. They do really, really lovely necklaces that have an initial and a birthstone on. And you pick both for the person and they're so stunning and gorgeous. And the chain is kind of a bit more detailed than usual. They're just really, really nice necklaces. I'd love to receive one of those. Next, Misoma. Anything Misoma. I'm obsessed with Misoma. I don't have anything from them, but I want everything. <laughs> um, yeah gorgeous necklaces for layering they kind of do more chokers that like all different all different lengths that you can layer with stuff really stunning jewelry and good all of these are gorgeously packaged so they're great gifts <laughs> um also the friendship bracelets um from monica winada are really cute and you can engrave them to make them super personal i also wanted to mention i have this name necklace from etsy it's not like your normal plate name it's like individual letters spread along the chain and it's i love it and i think that would be such a nice gift for someone and one that they would wear loads also lastly for jewelry astrid and miu earrings really gorgeous as well and obviously jewelry you know it lasts longer it's not like getting someone clothing you wear it over and over and over again sometimes every day so they're really good gifts so yeah definitely recommend jewelry if they suck <laughs> hey so that's everything. I know this has been a hell of a long video and I'm really sorry about that guys, but I didn't want to like shorten down the list in case like there was something in there that someone wanted, you know, or <laughs> something like that. So I made it a bit longer, but hopefully there's something in here for everyone. <laughs> so let me know if you've gained any inspiration from this, because if you have, I'd love to know that would literally make my week if I knew that um someone had gotten a gift idea from this it would just be the best um so definitely let me know also comment down below and let me know what your favorite gifts were what you would love to receive and also any future video requests from me because i make these videos for you guys so anything you want to see i'm happy to make so yeah if you enjoyed this please give it a thumbs up and a little comment down below and please please subscribe because oh my god we hit 500 subscribers and i'm so grateful it, it's just happened so quick and you're all so lovely oh, just thank you <laughs> it's so sweet so if you'd like to see more of my videos then please do feel free to subscribe i don't know where the button is but subscribe <laughs> and also like i said don't forget to check down below if you're looking for any of the gifts because they will be linked there and yeah i think that's it and so i'll see you guys in a couple of days for my gifts guide for him. So, a lot of you watching this will probably be like, oh, got my girl's gifts. Now, yeah, my guy's gifts. So, yeah. Gift guide for him coming out in a few days. And until then, I hope you guys have the best week and I'll see you very soon. Bye, guys. Thank you for watching.